women's game at the moment. If you, th I think that's why the likes of Kleisters, Sharapova is still involved. The Willie cope with the pressure of a match. That's the type of tennis we're going to look at, isn't it? And I guess you don't want to change who you are on the court. You maybe got to tone things down or just be a little bit more aware of things sometimes. moving and striking the ball pretty it's well. Leonard Belgium in football in the World Cup. And the mum gymnastics. Gymnastics, yep. Yeah. Kim hit that right off the frame, top of the frame. Got away with it. With quality, but if you then look to overpress, then errors can start to come off your racket. The difference on, on the clay, Kleisters loves to use that play. Slice serve out wide into the open court, but you've got so much more time. You saw there Yakimova managed to just regain her balance and get the lob up over the top of Kleisters. That's a great shot. I mean, Yakimova would have been happy with that return oh. deep in the backhand. Better point there from Yakimova. Reset, use her footwork. Adjust to the slower ball. So she faced a break point, Kim Kleisters. Hit away out of trouble. The three love lead here in the first set. Kleister's just showing us the firepower that she has at her... 15.30. Ball toss from Yakimova. Just have a look at this. That is... Immense. It's pretty high. Launches it up there. Well, she's got to wait an eternity for it to come back down. But uh, you just see here, she's forced to play two and three defensive shots in a row, and that's a case of diminishing returns. If you play one defensive shot, you've almost got to try to get back on the front foot. Ball just sitting there, close. Closest once that checked, I think out. Yeah. Four stairs to go down. Love thirty. Ah! 
Armstrong. Avantage, Mademoiselle Kleisters. Better margin there from Kim gets herself out of trouble. Bubka's son played That's tennis. Fine. Good touch from Kleisters. Well, this is good to see, isn't it? She's pretty much tried to hit her opponent off the court thus far, but showing us that she's got some touch as well. Yes. Easy ball, not Kim. Very quick to get in position. Seem to be a little bit more paid. Once your ball leaves the hand, it should be in play. Your book isn't the official rule book, is no, it? No, that's, well? that's true. Oh, Kleister's <laughs> just could sense the anxiety in the ball toss of Yakimova, and she was all over that. Five one, do this. She made that. 5 1 40 love that it would kick in. Egerity. Worth a try. I mean, she played a couple of defensive slices through the air quick enough. Second break point. Well, that's kind of Kim Kleister's in a nutshell. Capable. Zero but that's what you have to admire about her, regardless of the situation. It doesn't matter how many winners or errors that she has made, she's pretty uncompromising in her attitude. If it's there to hit, she'll go for it. Sat up nicely for her, took it on up the line. Another great return from Kleisters, took it on. Let's take one of these while. And she does just that, a stinging backhand. Gives Kleisters the first set, six games to two. And they aren't some of those pronunciations. League of Nations. Kleisters having taken the first 6 2. Serving. 15 all. I think it's important she gets some big first serves in. Quickly up. It's such a good tactic because you can go back behind your opponent. 
first forehand cross court and then you can see Yakimova looking to recover Kleister's sending the that was one thing that always surprised me when he come back from injury day one coming out of the middle just have a look at set one stats last year and then 2007-2009 had retired Once again, Yakimova forced to defend too many times in a row. Unable to finalist here all the way back in 2001, 10 years ago. Good aggressive tennis once again. Struggle, but she holds serve and races to a three love lead. Another good strike from Kleisters. It's a slightly shorter ball. She gets herself right up onto the baseline, takes it early. Too much running. Too many balls that she has to retrieve at full stretch. Unable to control that. all over that the feet a little tangled up in the net the days it's more used just to kind of start the point and then they really rely on their ground shots no, I think that's exactly right I mean I think even in, in the women's game the serve hasn't been the biggest weapon for a lot of players. It's been more the fact that they're able to return well and hit well off the, the ground. And as you say, it's, it's used really to... Finds it so hard to get on the front foot. Yeah, pretty much all of this match deep behind the baseline, isn't she?
drop shot from Yakimova. Close to seem to read it. Always a good shot on clay, the wrong footing shot. When you go to change direction sharply on clay, the surface gives way under your feet. Unity. You slide, just that fraction, watch Yakim over right there, the slide, you can't recover. Too big, too strong, Kip. She'll take it. No, no apologies from Yakimova. Trails 2 5, second set. sees the opportunity to move forward as the second drive volley just again good footwork keeps her eye on the ball and they're just guiding it up the line just about everything has an opportunity to hit a winner that was a bit ambitious 30 all <laughs> but she's unrelenting just keeps coming, Kim Clijsters likes to take the ball on the rise and she's been pretty good here. She's facing an ad point, let's see if she's a little more relaxed. Line, line. Two lines. When you watch Kim you, you sort of think of a boxer who Found the line. Good aggressive play there from Kleisters. Was quick up to the ball. A bit of footwork got herself in the right position. Well, this is why she loves hard courts, the US Open. She loves hitting the ball on the rise. And that's when she's at her most dangerous. But your hands have got to be pretty relaxed on impact. Oh. More 
pace on that last forehand from Christers. To be over, get into the second round, kind of get a teeth into the tournament. A bit of a nervy display trying to close this out. She's got to give her credit, she's sticking around. Quiet, even if it's just a three-quarter serve, but create some space to go for the winner so that it doesn't have to be on the line. Oh, that'll do. An error from Yakimova, who was, she was hanging tough, but really just not, really just not the artillery to really threaten King Clysters. No, and really all she hoped for was Clysters making some mistakes. Putting a lot of balls back into the court, but a lot of the time she was forced to defend and Kleister's just had too much weight of sometimes when you haven't played matches those emotions it would be a little bit more fatigued but she's in pretty good shape at the moment Kleister's and I think it's just all about her trying to get herself match tight by getting through these early rounds she's got a, a reasonable draw she is in the bottom half of the draw Sharapova's in that part who played incredibly well today against Lucic well, I don't think a win here at Roland Garros is beyond her, provided the injury doesn't flare up. I think she can get through to the second week.